formalities. I'm Peter Cleary, and I'm joined in the commentary box by the familiar figure of Jim Begley. Cheers, Peter. It's a privilege to be here. It really is. on all four sides rise to the national anthem. for pride and reflection as players and supporters stand for the national anthems. for this game. So well done to the goal scorer, but the keeper should have done a lot better. impressive so far I think every department has worked very well and I think what we're about to discover now is whether they can match that work rate and energy again in the second half they've got to try and keep this going leaving 1-0 at the break well 1-0 may be good enough so they may er oh he's broken through oh it's opened up nicely for him and the follow-up, it's in, two to the good, they have breathing space. Loris reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. Look, that's one of the first things you learn, whether you're a striker or not. Just anticipate a goalkeeping parry or spillage, and sometimes you'll get lucky to come your way. Front. Defenders on the back foot. Chance. Looking to shoot. They are rampant. And surely that settles it. Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement and when all of that is synchronized with the right pass that's what happens
and he put it away. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. It's there. Yet another goal in an awesome performance. They are in complete charge. And that's it. A great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? There's a solidity about them, almost as if they set up not to lose and see how things unfold. That eases the pressure on the strikers, who can afford to be patient, and it's all paid off. So just time for me to say thanks to Jim for...